Hundreds of elderly South and North Koreans separated by the Korean War have met for the first time in 60 years. They were only a handful of the millions of Koreans separated by the conflict and more reunions are planned over the coming days. Hundreds of North and South Koreans separated by the Korean War together for the first time in decades. <laughs> This 91-year-old man from South Korea asks his long-lost sister, Sister, what about our older brothers? Her reply, they're gone. The problem is that these people are getting old. Of those who had been registered since autumn, two in South Korea and three in North Korea have died. More and more people had to cancel the trip due to health problems. About 500 South Koreans and 260 North Koreans are taking part in this reunion. Now we can see our aunt and uncle. I'm your nephew. I missed you. North Korea is pushing for improved ties with South Korea. It's a marked change from last year when Pyongyang was making threats to launch nuclear strikes against Seoul and Washington. The rival nation struck a deal last week to go ahead with this meeting, but there'd been some doubt over whether it would go ahead. The North had earlier threatened to cancel the reunions if planned military drills went ahead between the United States and South Korea. A second meeting of war-divided families will take place on Sunday. Sam Belitho, ABC News.